hello guys so uh, in this video I will explain you that say if you have some categorical variable say a smoke earlier I explained you that how you can create a bar plot of it bar plot is nothing like it is just telling about the number of observations in each of the categories so smoke has only two categories it is uh, zero or one either the it is a smoking or not if it is a smoking then it is zero uh, it is one or non smoking is zero so uh, you i already explained that this code you select this and control enter you see the plot here it is just telling that the smokers and non smokers distribution that the smokers as one number of observations are lesser than the non smokers so the smokers are lesser than non smokers and how much you can see that's uh, by the numbers of observations here now what we want to see we want to say we want to distribute this smokers among the races we want to see that in which race uh, 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 the relation between race and the smoke so we want to see inside this uh, zero -th column uh, between zero to what is the fraction of each of the races and in this one column uh, smoke is equal to one this uh, this smaller column what is the distribution of uh, uh, races inside this so this can be easily done here what you need to do is just to write the same code but just write comma and write fill we are using now fill not coloring because these are not data points we have to fill the rectangles of this bars that's why the argument being used here is fill instead of uh, color size shape or so I will be telling you that you have to whenever you are dealing with uh, uh, rectangular bars you should use the fill instead of colors so now you write as dot factor and just raise and now you have two variables here and just control select it and then hit control enter you can see what you can see here is that the when the smoke is zero um, what is the distribution of rays so you can see that the blue is larger fraction of this complete rectangle on the left hand side and then the smallest fraction of this non smokers is uh, green which is the two category in the rays so you it is it is visible that in inside this uh, columns the higher fraction is of the third category of the rays in the in the smokers you can also see that red is quite high red is quite high much higher than the blue ones so in the smokers you can see that the red rays is having high uh, smoking as shown in the this data set and the green and the blue is equally likely so green and blue categories of rays they uh, they are equally likely in the in the smoking so this is how you can treat two categorical variables so you can just plot bar plot of one categorical and fill it with the other categorical variable next video i will explain you more about how you can deal with the more and more variables so thanks for watching this video